guys, welcome to Gaming Gaming TV. Today, we are going for a wee spin in the uh, Magnum 380. We are going to go down to the shops to uh, get a wee bit of equipment that's going to help us. coming episode because I've come up with an idea in this big flat bit here I want to put a shed there but my house is in the way and that little shed behind it anyway I don't think that little shed's going to come but I'm thinking of moving my house probably back here maybe I think it'll be a bit nicer back here but we uh, need to get the trees down in that first. So I'm going to go and pick up a few bits and bats so that we can do this. Woo! That is a big ass fingers on the thing there. I mean, hanging around with the boys too much today, that's why I keep saying daddy and stuff. Uh, get the old beacons on. So we'll have a wee tour around. Either this video or the next one, because I've got, I think I've got all the equipment I need now. To play how I want, so I'm going to dump a load of cash. Um, just have maybe 50, 60 grand left over, just in case. Anything I can think of. Um, those are the... Uh, just there just to get it set up how I want so that I can play how I want. All no point in map. This let's play should be. In this way, I think I can go. Yeah, right, so we've got a trailer. See? Not a massive one, but it'll do. What we also need is a stump grinder and um, uh, what's what I call it? What these things are these stump grinders now? Three stumps and bushes. Oh, these are new. It's a that thing. Oh, look at that thing. Jeez. That's a beast, isn't it? We need to remove tree stumps and bushes. Going down tree stumps and chipper or that the wood chipper I just need to lease lease that too should pretty much be it right hoping Can fit also on the front. And then I can pick one of the other ones up on the back. Oh, frost. Wonder if I line it up around it. I think I have a PT on the front of it. Happy days. Here. Is the big question. Can I? That is scary looking. Hook the trailer on and then hook. That to the trailer and have a little. Train going. I think before with a couple of trailers. I think it's a PTO shaft.
Yeah, it's because it has a shaft, maybe. <sighs> Damn it. And that will not have anything on the back to hook anything more on, will it? Oh, Two trips it is, then. Two trips it is. Now I think there was a problem with cutting trees now. Apparently it fired them into space. Now I have tried the lob a tree now. Seems to be grand. So fingers crossed. I can get these down. And what I want to do is I'll move the house first so I can get it into position of where I want it. Um in fact, where's the options? Because I want to adjust something. I can't adjust it here. Right, one second. Right, there we go. I was looking for auto save. So we've got that off at the minute. Just while I'm doing this. Because if it auto saves. My goof, then that's not God. It took me a while shifting all these flipping machines down here, so <laughs> we don't want that. Hello? Shame when it's mulchy, you don't get. I don't know how this works. I've not seen these big ones before. These are new. I'm used to that little stump grinder, like. I do have a couple of bushes near it too, so this, this could be really handy for getting rid of them. But I want my house down here, to be honest. I'm hoping it's going to go in with no flipping hassle. <sighs> you never know with these, though. That, that middle ground might be better because it's flatter. That's Drop that off of there. Drop that off there. We'll go get the other thing and then we'll sort out whoop, where the house is going. Oh, my steering today is shocking. Right. Yeah, that middle bit might be better and then I can do fencing around it all and put a garden there or something. Do some proper landscaping for my house this time. So, we're pretty, took a few episodes, guys, but we're pretty much there now with this multi million dollar farm. I think I've got everything I need. It's going to be a little like Millennial, oh, millennial Farmer's Farm. Probably going to do corn, soybeans. Um, oh, I've got some nice case tractors here. Uh, I love the case combine, so it was really more like uh, Welkers, really. All the case equipment. No, no big buds in this game, it is. There? I don't know. Uh, Precision Farm is going to be out soon as well, guys. There is some new additions to it. It'll be interesting. You can buy the soil maps now, which to me, yeah, is a little boring. Um, I would hope if they do something like that, then they'll make it so it's not as accurate. Maybe. Would be a nice thing. So it would be more accurate if you do it yourself. I'm still going to do it myself. I'm not going to do that because I, I, like, I like the procedure of going out and drilling the ground and getting all the gear. I think that's pretty cool. Hopefully this thing is alright because I don't want to keep any... Any of the tree, any logs, out. everything needs to be mulched down, and then I'll flog the mulch, or maybe even get a. I'm not sure if the heaters are on this with for the wood chip. Oh, wait up, sir! Thank you very much. Deer everywhere. Um, maybe get a heater. 
and use the wood chip for that. But I haven't actually noticed that in game, I haven't really looked. But we will have a booty zook. Oh, recording this on St. Patrick's Day. Green machine. You know, blends you really well. <laughs> Had a good day though, went to uh, we parade with the boys and the missus. Really cool. I think uh, the boys' heads almost exploded when they saw superheroes uh, like uh, Captain America and Captain Marvel and Groot and all that. Lot. I think the heads really popped. But it was fun. So we're nearly back at the farm. <laughs> Now, this has only come about because I've been trying and trying and trying to get this flipping shed that I want on the land over there, but because it's all up and down all over the place, it just wasn't fitting. Now, I know this area is fairly flat. These two, well, this, yeah, these two trees here I might have to go to. Um... Yeah, we'll just back this up for now. The fencing is going to have to go. Pressing because it took me ages to do that fence. I don't, I can't remember if that shed is an add on or it was here already. I actually can't remember. They, they're going to have to be moved too, to be honest. That and the lamp. Um, let's have a look. Construction. So here's the... The farmhouses. Uh, I think I can't use it now. Is it that one? No, it's that one. Much nicer to be honest. Uh, shit. Decorative, maybe, was it? Others. Oh, yeah, decorative, right. That's okay. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Right. So, it looks like we're going to have to demolish this house first. Get rid of that. Hello, oh, little monitor. We'll redo that later. All the fence has to go. Well, that's good, you can just keep your finger down. Uh... Right, right. So, kick out that a minute. Shift the good old truck. Come on, warm up. Put it under here. So here is my plan. See that shed there? It's a lovely shed. It would actually fit there really nicely. I think. Everything looks fairly flat land wise, there's no ups and downs. Oh, I'll make sure I'll flatten it out myself. Or and I may have to shift them actually. I'll maybe do that now while I think about it. Just to get it in. We're actually jogging on this episode, so we might not get. Them actually cut down, but you'll see the idea. Now, I hate these because I cannot um, steer them. Terrible at backing these things up. Because of the, I wish, I wish there was a way you could lock it off. You know, there should be a way you can lock 
of them uh, things just for, for backing things up. Either hydraulically or even physically stick a pin in. Stop them from moving. These can stay here for now. Mm. Big head is like. Right, so. Feels fairly flat around there. Park right there. So. Time. So I thought I had it. So we'll get a still, still, still. There's actually a dealer near me that sells all that sort of stuff. Oh, actually, no. We'll get the house down first. Otherwise, I've nowhere to spawn. <laughs> that one, man. Well, I think around here will be lovely. Now, I'm hoping it's not going to mess. I have to do some landscaping then. Try and flatten out all this area. Doesn't have to be much, but not digging a hole when I put it down. Hate it. Right, before I do. Where's the thing? I'm gonna save. If this goes wrong, I can start again. I don't think I want it in the middle. That looks a bit weird. I think I want it off to one side. A little bit back. Put the garage on the back of it. See, this, this is what I hate. You should be able to move it up and down. Beautiful, beautiful. That has not messed the land up at all. Excellent. Just what I want. Bigger, a bit stronger, and then just... That's it. amazing. I can put my wee sheds out. I'll do that in another video. That'd be cool. Right, so the house is moved. And I didn't goof it, so that is good. So here is a tree we need to cut. So do this one first. I'll get it going. What was that sort of way onto the Not a big stump, that but Lovely. This bad boy's really sort of into it ish. Mm, the tree seems to cut better. I mean, you're cutting it, look, it's giving that little angle on it. But it's dropping the way you want it to. These bushes are here too, so. Try and get these to drop this one to the concrete. Okay. 
Oh, okay, so they have improved. Bitcoin, which is good, because I used to love doing some forestry. That goes the right way, because there's a big tree. Yes. I need to get some of these. Oof. Excellent. That is a good job. Now I just need to branch it and trim it up and get ready. Dink. Oh, I wouldn't mind doing another forestry episode. I did used to love doing this forestry. Um. I haven't really looked at the maps for forestry because I heard that the trees were that buggy. I haven't actually looked yet. I'm just going to be a bit smaller for you now, maybe. Go. Yeah, I just thought I don't think I'm going to pick these up, am I? Motion might get that because I can't. <laughs> Attached to that man. Saw someone there, saw someone. There we go. No, oh, just cleaning the branches up a bit. Ready for chucking in the uh, the machine. So that's actually not doing too bad. That's going great. And then what we'll do is we'll flatten this land off. And we'll get it ready for the new big shed, which should fit here beautifully. Now that they're down, because this shed huge generates cash and it will fit open something like that maybe um and then there can be storage at the back there but the storage are at the side because <clears throat> if you look over here i still have a lot of stuff i mean yes it's under shelter but <clears throat> it is out and I'm not too keen on that. Plus, there's actually a door straight through it, so I can bring them in straight on the other side. Of this equipment here, that was a bit of a pain to reverse from so this. Maybe it's getting changed too. It has that there. So, we've got uh, the big scene or two. So, we've got the gear. It's just some of it I don't know, like. I don't know. It's just this on the back again. For reversing, there should be something where you can just dink lock it. And it can't twist then. I don't I don't know why there isn't stuff like that on these. Because reversing things like this is an absolute ball ache. If you're just going straight back, you know right I've got it set. 
bump, press a button, or get out and put a pin in. Grand. I hate reversing them things. I'm really, I cannot do it for save my life. I really can't. But that is going to do this episode, guys. I have to go and make tea for me in the missus. So, thank you for watching. If you like what you've seen, you know the score. Please go down below. Thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. And hit the wee bell. ding a ling a ling Helps other people come to the channel. And watch the farming sim and other stuff, including now VR. Um, also, if you want to help support the channel, guys, so that I can do more reviews uh, of software, hardware, um, VR stuff now, and also um, get more games for this place and whatnot, there is a link down below for Gavi Gaming TV merchandise. We've got the usual hoodies, t shirts, mouse mats, extra, extra large mouse mats, which I still need to get for myself and one for work. Um, we also have mugs, so you can have a brew. While you're watching me, great mugs. There's uh, one with just a logo on, and then there's one with a uh, beer eat. Two thumbs up, because you know, end of the day, it's gonna be right. Um, there is also, uh, I think there's a phone cases on there. I'm not sure what they're for, but they're for Samsung and iPhone, I can't remember now. Um, I do need to go on there and refresh some of the stuff. Um, but if you want to help support the channel, guys, but not purchase anything physical, also a link down below for PayPal. Every contribution helps and everything goes back into the channel, guys. So, thank you for watching. See you in the next one.